This week I'm testing the Midrive Bike Tricks Classic 750 watt e-bike. And I'd like to see how this model compares to the dual hub version that I tested recently and that was by far the most powerful, fastest electric bike hub drive version that I tested so far on this channel. Now Bike Tricks does things differently and it's a better different. Bike Tricks and CYC are the only companies that I know that are pushing the boundaries on how powerful, how much more an electric bike can offer. I really like that this brand is looking how to develop more exciting product line and I recently learned about the XD Duo version. And this is why I think e-bikes soon will take over motorcycles. The power delivery of 2300 watts and 300 Nm of torque is insane. I think with faster shifting and a more fit person, you can get much higher top speed and fast acceleration. And I really hope to test this model in 2023. While I'm still playing and ride testing and finalizing the review of this 750 watt mid-drive electric bike, take a look at this insanity of an electric bike. I think this is the best dual drive I have seen online so far, and I think it will stay in that position for 2022 and the most of 2023. Introducing the most powerful and durable electric bike we've ever made. This is the Bitrix XD. Featuring our revolutionary dual drive powertrain, the XD was designed to push the limits of what an e-bike can do. Boasting a massive 2,000 watt motor with over 300 newton meters of torque, the XD sits safely at the top of the food chain. Just watch what happens when it goes head to head against what used to be the most powerful motor out there. One thousand watt Bafang Ultra Motor is the Bitrix XD. This time, we've got three competitors. First up, a regular pedal bike, then the 1000 watt Bafang Ultra e-bike, and of course, the XD. We decided to give these guys a bit of a head start, you know, to be fair. I have to stop this and talk over this. This is completely wrong. 1000 mid-drive Bafang would not struggle on this hill. We'll go slower than the XD version, but will not fail. By now it should be clear that this bike is like nothing else out there, but let's talk about why. Traditional mid-drives use standard bicycle components to transfer power from the motor to the back wheel. It's the same sprockets, chains and cassettes that you'd find on any old pedal bike. These components do fine in a situation like that, where an experienced cyclist might produce 500 watts. But add a 1000 watt motor and now you've got 1500 watts going through the same powertrain. That's why you get stretched and broken chains strip cassettes, and all kinds of other reliability issues that keep you in the shop and off the trails. With the XD system, we let the pedal bike components handle exactly what they were made for, pedaling. And on the other side, we've got a beefy 219 chain and heavy duty custom sprockets that take 2000 watts of power from the motor to the back wheel, increasing both performance and reliability. 
To demonstrate just how durable this drivetrain is, we're going to task the XD system with something completely unreasonable. You know, usually if I'm going to haul a trailer, I use a truck like this. But today, I've been told I'm in the mood for a bike ride. I think that this is one of those times where you really don't have to tell anybody don't do this at home, you know? I mean, this trailer is like 1,750 pounds. And the fact that it could tow it without breaking in half is astonishing, honestly. I was sure we were gonna find the uh, failure mode of this whole thing today, and I don't know, I'm not sure if we are actually gonna find it. Like, when is this gonna break? Where is this gonna break? Or am I, am I what's gonna break? <laughs> Whoa, there she goes! <laughs> Alright. I don't really think it's good to be good at this. You know, any normal mid-drive bike, it would snap the chain before this test even got started. But uh, I haven't heard a single snap or pop or any, any bad signs coming from our XC drive. It's just handling this beautifully. I don't want to say this is working, but the, the drivetrain is working, that's for sure. <laughs> 